Hey everyone, this is Hodges1455 coming at you with another video. In today's video, I'm going to show some recent pickups from one of my local card shops here. I'm going to split it up into two videos. Uh, this first card here is 1962 Tops. It's got the 61 National League batting leaders on it with Roberto Clemente, Veda Pinson, Ken Boyer, and Wally Moon. Just thought this card was great looking. It's a little off center, but golly. It's got a little tiny fish eye on the back, but really great. Super happy to add another Clemente. The next card I have here is a 1966 Topps ribos of Kurt Flood. This is a really cool looking card. A rub off, actually. And, uh, really just couldn't get over the condition of these. These are, I mean, not just paper thin. They are, golly, they're super, super thin. But I thought this one had really nice color on it. Even the back looked nice. Really happy to add one of these to my collection. Next card I have here is a card I've been trying to get my hands on for a little while. It's this 1970 Tops Al Oliver. Um, at the same card shop, I had found one of these, but it had really rounded edges, and he wanted three times as much as what I ended up getting this one for. So it's got the little tiny crease up here on the top right, but I thought it looked really sharp. Other than that. Great looking picture of them. That's what the back looks like. But love the rookie cup. And the batting cage behind them. It's a great looking card. Next, I have this uh, 1971 Tops Al Oliver. So now I have his 70 and his 71. what the back looks like and got two more 71 tops here I got this uh, Doc Ellis great looking card and this third one here of uh, Louis Tiant. It's sharp. It's got this little tiny touch down here, but just incredible. I love the picture on it. And great card of Louis Tiant. Should be getting into the Hall of Fame here soon. Next, I have a couple. 1972 Topps cards I hadn't picked up yet. This first one here is the 71 AL Strikeout Leaders. I was happy to pick this one up. And same goes with this 71 AL Pitching Leaders card. Hadn't picked one up yet of this. So, happy to get this one. And last 72 tops here is this AL Home Run Leaders card. It's got Bill Melton, Norm Cash, and Reggie Jackson. Great looking card. That's what the back looks like. And then I have a couple 73s I was able to pick up. I believe I already have this card, but... It's such a neat looking card, and I thought this was a really nice condition. It's got the slightest bit of snowing going on. It's a little off center, but such a cool picture of Juan Marichal dealing. That's what the back looks like. And 
And then the last 73 tops here is this uh, 2015 buyback of Dave Johnson. I think this is only like my, I think I only have one buyback. So I'm starting to keep an eye out. Add a couple of these. Gives me an excuse to pick up a guy like Dave Johnson. So it's a great looking card of him. What the back looks like. And also, I don't believe I had any from this set yet. The 1973 Kellogg's Superstars. And found this nice looking Mickey Lolich. Nice looking picture of him. Got the perforated edges there. But really nice picture of him. It's a pretty cool looking card. So I was happy to find that. And then off with all the vintage, they had this little tiny section of just random cards. So I'm, I'm not sure what was going on there, but I went through and found a couple gems. This Michael Jordan card that I just couldn't find growing up as a kid. Dealers would sell out as soon as they got them in. That's what the back looks like. This next card is Bernie Williams. Great looking card of him. Minor league card, Columbus Clippers. And this card was also in that same little section. The Ricky Henderson, sure dominance. This was a really neat looking card. Happy to pick up this Ricky. And last card here from the same set, Sure Dominance, King Griffey Jr. Hey everyone, thanks for watching and enjoy the hobby.